Here's a look at the Big 12 championship bracket for tomorrow evening. The Jayhawks won the early semifinal, Texas and TCU in the late game. They're in the second half right now in the Big 12 men's and women's championships are expected to bring in $21 million for Kansas City. That can vary a bit. It depends on how long out-of-state fans stay in the tournament, and it doesn't get much bigger than the Iowa State and KU fan bases. Yeah. Fox Sports' Dave DeMarco is live with a look at what that rivalry looked like before they hit the court today. Yeah, both of these fan bases live and breathe college basketball. I'm sure wants to win every game. Of course, it was the Jayhawks that won tonight. But I say this seems like a pretty friendly rivalry where everyone out here was having a great time. Power and light. It was hard to tell who had more fans, the Kansas Jayhawks. Let's hear it one more time here, Kansas Jayhawk band is here. Oh, it's amazing. I come down here every year. KU's off the chain. We always win in it. Or Iowa State Cyclones. All kinds of Iowa State fans oh, in there goodness. having a good time. We sang the five song. I heard Sweet Caroline a little bit earlier. The man leading the Iowa State chants, alumni director Jeff Johnson, gives credit to Kansas City being so welcoming. He says Iowa State fans have never forgotten many making the trip every year. Our fans are rabid and they're everywhere. We have 280,000 living graduates, probably twice that number of fans. They travel well, they respect the cities they're in. They're just incredible to be in front of. But not every four hour drive from Iowa is for the Cyclones. Bakers live in Iowa, but have been season tickets for a decade in Lawrence. Game where we did a boomerang trip. We'd come down, we'd watch the game, turn around and go home, and I'd be at work by six o'clock. For alumni like recent national champion Mitch Lightfoot, used to seeing all the excitement in the arena, a new perspective on just how big the Big 12 championship really is. Yeah, I think you can look around and see the amount of support here. This is a serious event. People take this super serious, and uh, all the players are so lucky to be able to play for uh, these fans. Okay, I'll come back to Kansas City and have me a good time one more time. All right? And I'm not sure if Jimbo is down there, but I still do see some of these Iowa State fans despite the loss out here and others partying out here tonight. But it's going to be the Jayhawks that are on the court tomorrow back here for that matchup and a tight one going on right now between Texas and TCU to see who will face them. Lauren. Well, for all of you folks from Ames who came down, we are so glad you're here. Sorry about the loss, but we sure love having you in Kansas City. Dave DeMarco and Power Light. Thank